All I can say is the biggest AI rivalry has now started. And what if I will tell you that it is between Microsoft and Google? You will be amazed to know that Microsoft CEO Satya Nadella confirms $10 billion investment into ChatGPT as it got huge success. On the other hand, Google CEO Sundar Pichai was quite frustrated as he has asked his employees to focus on the AI tool which showed inaccurate data at the launching event of Google Bard. Now let me tell something about these two chatbots. First, let's start with ChatGPT. It is an AI language model that is taking the world by storm. Do you know what is the full form of ChatGPT? It is Chat Generative Pre-trained Transformer. I know, it seems a bit difficult to say, right? And what about Google Bard? It is an experimental conversational AI service powered by Lambda which stands for Language Model for Dialogue Applications. Google Bard and ChatGPT are two of the most prominent chatbots available in 2023. But which is better? As both offer natural language responses to natural language inputs, using machine learning and millions of data to craft useful and informative responses for the users. As the hype got real, soon after the launch of ChatGPT, Many tech personalities like Narayan Murthy, Bill Gates, as well as the Gmail founder appreciated the chatbot, ChatGPT, due to its extraordinary features. To know more details about ChatGPT, let's dig into the topic first. To start with it, we will try to know what is ChatGPT. ChatGPT was launched on November 30, 2022 and its valuation was estimated at $29 billion in 2023. ChatGPT is a large language model chatbot developed by OpenAI based on GPT 3.5. Due to high demand of the users, we often get to see this that ChatGPT is at max capacity. You don't need to worry about it as it happens when a lot of engagement is going on the server. And if you are a GPT Plus subscriber, then maybe you can get the access more easily. Now the question is how it really works. Basically, it generates text-based answers and help us to code. From finding the error to actually improving it, within few seconds, ChatGPT has been doing wonders. After seeing this, the growth of ChatGPT, among the users, Google had started panicking as they wanted a more advanced rival chatbot from their side to compete with ChatGPT. They recently launched their own chatbot, Google Bard, in a press conference which came out as a huge failure resulting in shares of Google's parent company to lose more than $100 billion in market value. As we are already discussing about Google's Bard, now let's move on to the next topic of our video. What is Google Bard? I am going to answer this question as we move ahead in this video. Google Bard is similar to OpenAI's ChatGPT, as it is latest experimental AI service that can respond to various queries and requests in a conversational manner. At the heart of Google Bard, it is an experimental technology, Lambda, which is a transformer, a neural network architecture. Soon after the two tech giants launched their products, everybody started thinking, which one is better? To get the answer without any delay, let's talk about the elephant in the room, which is ChatGPT versus Google Bard. Let's start with the ChatGPT. It is an artificial intelligence chatbot developed by OpenAI built on OpenAI's GPT-3 family of large language models. Google Bard developed by Google and it is a convolutional neural language model. Secondly, you need to know that ChatGPT is based on GPT-3.5 and has a remarkable ability to interact in conversational dialogue form and it can provide responses that can appear surprisingly human. On the other hand, Google Bard is an experimental conversational AI service powered by Google Lambda. You will be surprised to know that Google Bard will inform users by finding the latest high quality answers and it means that Google's latest AI tool can give users information about the current scenario. While on the other hand, ChatGPT is not connected to the internet and it can occasionally produce incorrect answers as it has limited knowledge of world till 2021 and may also occasionally produce harmful instructions or biased contents. As we come to the new levels of AI chatbots, given the many ways AI is tested, 
people want to test how sophisticated such chatbots are. Whether ChatGPT or Google Bard are plagiarism free is a question on lot of lips. ChatGPT supports plagiarism checker, but OpenAI has also clearly stated that tool isn't fully reliable yet and should not be used as a primary way to identify copy text. On the other hand, Google Bard is not that developed to have a AI text classifier. After all the factors, the most important point of the discussion is whether ChatGPT or Google Bard free for the users. Till date, ChatGPT has allowed research content previews for free, but also has a subscription model to get more enhanced results. As I have told previously that Bard is still under beta phase, so it's completely free for now. Both the AI chatbots have their own capabilities and limitations. But what exactly matters is how beneficial they are going to be for us in future. Take it as education sector or research sector or advanced language models. But for me now, ChatGPT is in lead. But soon after Google Bard comes with personalized search option, it's gonna be a hell of a ride for the tech users. On that note, we have come to the end of this video. Do share your views on which chatbot is better suited to you in the comment box. Until then, happy learning.